Yeah, bring them over. <laughs> tell us everything. I'll tell you everything. My life story. <laughs> um, I'll tell you about Zari, my, my character. Um, she's from the future. So near, um, but you know, 13 years, things happen, and and the future is a pretty scary and bleak place. Um, and she is a very powerful woman, and she speaks her mind, and she's a activist in, in the future. Um, but she doesn't quite see eye to eye with all the legends at first um, because. I think philosophically, like she's like, we shouldn't just fix um, ministry, we should improve it, because she's living in this authoritarian health. Um, <laughs> she's like, we need to fix this, <laughs> and we need to change this. Um, so yeah, I think she sort of challenges the, the legends, um, their like, system of rules. And yeah, it's going to be interesting to see kind of how she becomes a, a part of the team. Are there any team members that you could see her bonding with? I know that she and Ray, I think they're sort of opposites, but I, I think they're going to become good pals. Yeah, yeah. I, he's like such a glass half full kind of guy, and, and I think she's going to challenge, Zari's going to challenge Ray in an interesting way because she's like, listen, I've seen the future, it's not good. She's not glass half empty, but she's a realist, I think. Um, so yeah, it's going to be it's going to be interesting to see like how, how these characters um, interact. It's going to be really serious in a show that is more and more embracing the media and tone. I don't know that that's true. I think she's funny. <laughs> um, I think she's funny, and she's you know what she is. She's like she tells it how it is. Um, I think she's definitely. Um, not holding back any punches, but she's she's really good at throwing a jab, you know. And she's from the future. She's not impressed with the Wave Rider. She's like, this is like a museum, <laughs> and she and she lets them know she's not impressed with Ray's exosuit. She's like, this is. What are you, Robocop? So, um, yeah, yeah, she, I, I think she's gonna be funny. I'm certainly gonna fight for her to be funny. <laughs> how, yeah. are, how are her fight skills? Uh, great question. I, I mean, when I first got the role, I thought she would just be, I thought I would just be doing this as a hacker. Um, but I think that she's gonna have some powers that she's not even aware of at the beginning, and she's gonna discover those. And I think she's gonna, I think the physicality will come in with that. The character has some background. Um, yeah, she's a total badass. Yeah, yeah. Right. So there, there's some of she's like with Wonder Woman. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Have they, I mean, how, how far ahead do you know? I know there's not a lot to talk about, but how brief were you on what, what your characters are going to be? Um, I don't know a lot. Um, but I hope that she, I hope that she kind of lives up to um, that part of the comic, you know. And being this like very powerful, influential woman, you know. Um, and she went like head to head with Wonder Woman in the comics, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah, I love that. I hope, I hope, I hope that happens. <laughs> How to stop? Is it been preparing for any of the action? Or? Um, I sort of have been trying to eat sen sensibly and like work out, but um, I think I think I don't quite know what I'm in for yet. So we'll see. <laughs> I mean, just talk about joining a show in its third season. Like, what's it been? like for, for you? Um, well, I have like a lot of social anxiety, so there's there's that. And I met everyone this morning. Really? This oh, morning. Really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, this morning, okay. and then I, feel, I fly to Vancouver tomorrow, and then I start shooting in a week. So, um, yeah, it's all, it's all very new, but everyone is so nice, um, and it's been really, really, really welcoming, and I'm really grateful for that, because... Yeah, they don't have to be, and they're, they're in their own group, but yeah, they've been really lovely. Can you talk a little bit about the audition process then? Or was, uh, what did you have to do? Um, I auditioned in New York City. I, I auditioned 
auditioned in New York, and then I flew out to LA and auditioned for um, Phil and then some other producers. And actually, it was like, as far as auditions go, like pretty, pretty easy. And I was just so excited by the material, which I can't talk about. But I was so ex excited by the audition material. Like sometimes you just get an audition that like fits in your mouth. And this did, and uh, I thought this was like, just such an interesting character. And I'm, yeah, I was, I was just crossing my fingers that it worked out, so I'm so glad it did. So yeah. is that your scene? Is that what it did? It was. I mean, I don't know if those are going to necessarily make it in, but I hope they do. They were great.